Hallo guys, welcome back, welcome to my channel, Nihon Kara Konnichiwa, herzlich willkommen. So guys, I give you an update on Lucid, since we had now here a bearish price action last week. Um, yeah, I give you here the price targets based on the chart to the up and also to the downside. We have to talk here about a short squeeze, short squeeze scenario, which is possible for Lucid, but also we have to talk about the bear case scenario. So I give you here the prediction based on the chart. This is not a financial advice, guys. This is just my opinion based on my experience and based on the technicals here, what the chart is telling us, guys. So, yeah, first of all, before we here uh, dive into the details in the chart, guys, we have here an RSI pattern for Lucid. You can see since we had the IPO here in 2020, when I zoom out here a little bit in the chart, make this a little bit more small, then you can see Lucid had a big short squeeze here after the IPO. The IPO price is usually usually $10 or when you convert uh, spec companies into a, a tradable stock, then you have here uh, an IPO price of $10 and you can see Lucid squeezed to $64. So you can uh, yeah could uh, make a six time higher profit here, 600% profit almost here with Lucid. Then we had something here like a potential double top pattern not 100% but in this area here guys and you can see since we had this second peak here in November 2021 as you know guys most of the stocks squeezed in 2021 between January and yeah November 2021 a lot of stocks squeezed meme stocks you know everything uh, was squeezing here and the same did lose it and since then guys unfortunately we came down and you can see already here in the volume profile that something is going on here uh, people without experience think this is good, you know, when we have increasing volume, guys, but the honest truth is that this is normally caused by delusion. And what means delusion? In German we say Verwässerung. That means that they pump more shares into the market here. The company owners pump more shares into the market, try to gain more capital here. So Lucid is still a very, very healthy company based on the market capital. The market capital is 6.9 billion. This is huge, guys. But you can see that we are far away here from $64. The actual price is $3, guys. And this is maybe still not the bottom for Lucid, guys. So let's dive in into the chart. So what I identified here for you guys is we have here, in my opinion, this main trend channel. We have, of course, a lot of support and resistance zones. I will show you all the details here in the chart. But in my opinion, guys, based on the algos, yeah, this has nothing to do with human here. These are just algos, um, high frequency computers, which um, yeah, which generating here this price action for Lucid and we trading here in this trend channel, guys. What does that mean? So first of all, I will delete those lines because that was already in the past where I mentioned here when we have upside and downside potential for Lucid. And now we can see, guys, that we trading here within this trend channel and we hit the bottom of this trend channel, had a bounce. So every time when Lucid is... You can see the last fake out was here in January 2023. Then we had a short squeeze after this fake out. This is normally what happens when you have trading pattern like that. And since then, guys, since we came back here in this trend channel, Lucid is compressed here since March 2023 within this trend channel. We have small fake outs, but nothing special. We are here, by the way, in the weekly chart. So one candle is one week. So what to expect, guys? I will just uh, disable for a second here the indicators to make it more visible for you. Yeah, as I said, guys, we are compressed. We are compressed here in a bearish trend channel. Yeah, this is a big problem because that means that we potentially have still no, no bottom in because every time when we hit the bottom of this trend channel here, you can see we have some bounces to the upside. Yeah, it happened here, it happened here, it happened here, it happened here. So every time when we have this bounces here, guys, we have some, uh, sorry, this, um, this touch points here on the bottom, we have some bounces. But the, I call these always bear steps. So we always have, of course, bear flex building here. But you have to imagine like a, like a, um, yeah, like a step stair, like a stair here. You always go down. You have this uh, this stair. Then you go down stair, go down stair, go down. This is what the short sellers doing. They try to, you know, bring retail back to buy in here in the stock by making some volatile price actions. But by the end, guys, if you hold this stock after a few months or even years, you just lose your money, guys. That's why for quick swing trades, Lucid is a very, very good stock. Don't get me wrong, we have here also a short squeeze potential. So we could see a really huge short squeeze incoming here for Lucid. But 
as, as long guys as we're trading here in this trend channel pattern i would not talk about a short squeeze for lucid so when we now uh, switch here back to the indicators guys then you can see that we are here compressed in an rsi pattern here you can see since we had the ipo and the short squeeze here this red algo trend line on the rsi guys on the weekly rsi is compressing the price you can see every time when lucid try to break out we get rejected here guys and still one more attempt here was one more attempt with this candle here we tried to break out here out of this pattern but you can see we failed again and yeah as long as we're failing here guys there will no no short squeeze possible for lucid because the algos are in control here and i will show you that the short sellers are loading up here and try to bring the stock price even more down so when we switch now here to the weekly chart sorry to the daily chart by the way guys if, if this is uh, too complicated what i'm talking here i try to make it um, as easy as possible i hope you can understand and follow what i'm showing you here in the chart even there are so many lines and drawings but i have here a membership guys my elite circle membership so if you want to learn more in trading guys if you want to understand those details and want to draw those kinds of charts by yourself so if you are a complete beginner guys it's no problem you can join in here the elite circle membership just go on the main page of my channel here i have three memberships to show your love and support membership is something like a super chat this is if you want to just support the work which i'm doing here every day on youtube but if you really want to learn on trading guys then the elite circle membership here is the way to go and of course beside uh, of course i my main goal is just to educate people i normally don't yeah, I want that you just copy my trades, but of course I will show you here a lot of hidden short squeeze stocks which are squeezing yeah, almost every day in the market. We have almost every day short squeeze in the US market, guys, but the problem is how to find these stocks and then uh, yeah, when to enter those stocks. The timing is very important and if the stock starts to squeeze, how to trade them. This is very difficult. This is why most of the traders lose their money, but this is what I try to you know provide here right here for you i show you my hidden short squeeze indicators that you know how to trade these stocks with the help of these indicators of course it's still a learning pro uh, progress guys but this is of course everything i provide here for you and if you have any stock which you don't find here on youtube where you want which stock you maybe want to buy you plan to buy i do also chart analyze on request guys yeah i don't care about clicks this is for members only so if you have any stock that you want me to analyze guys you can join in here the elite circle membership and i do that for you guys just for example, we had here a huge short squeeze again last week. That happens almost every day. Of course, we don't trade every day 120% squeezes, but that happens really, really frequently, guys. And I provide you the information always before a short squeeze happens. That's why I say if you want to trade something like that, then you can just join in here. The membership, guys. Um, my chart analyzer, I always use TradingView for my chart analysis. So if you also plan to get a TradingView access, you can, of course, use TradingView for free. This is no problem, but when you use trading view, trading view for free, you have a really, really limited access to indicators. For example, the hidden short squeeze indicators, which I present for my members only, they are not available here for the free version. So if you plan to get a um, trading view version, guys, in every video, you can click here in the uh, description, in the description settings here uh, below the video. And there is a link where you can save $15 if you create your trading view account. I always recommend to use the plus a subscription of course you can also go for the premium but for beginners i think the plus subscription is good and then you have uh, i think 10 indicators uh, available to uh, implement in one chart layout guys and here is a link where you just can save 15 dollars i know it's not that much but better than nothing guys why not using this link if you can save some money here so let's go back to lucid sorry for the for this small uh, um yeah Ex, ex, uh, how to say that uh, yeah you know what i mean guys so let's go back to lucid here so when we see now the chart we have a hidden signal in the chart because this, the price gapped down here we had a gap down of the price which means we have a new open gap and as you know guys or as you don't know the chance that we close gaps to the up or downside is about 90 percent guys so here is a hidden signal in the chart which means lucid will come back any day or you know in the future at three dollar and fifty six cents this is more or less guaranteed this is something which always happens in trading so you can see already how we had the bounce here we had something like a double bottom confirmation here exactly at the 1618 fibonacci level you can see my previous videos on that i never changed the chart here and you can see as we had this huge sell-off here and then of course after when you have something like a leg down like this there will always always be a leg up 
and you can see we have a double bottom here we had a shakeout with an open gap to the downside then had this nice squeeze candle here but you can see the price is compressed here by the purple EMA line so in my opinion guys I have no doubts that we you know that we start maybe to trade sideways here a little bit but we will close this gap at $3.57 we have also one open gap at $4.71 that's why I say when we talk about the short squeeze scenario, that will be our next price targets. But in my opinion, guys, as long as we are compressed here in this trend channel, that means we maybe trade a little bit sideways, close this gap here, you know, touch the top of this trend channel here before we come even further down. Yeah, and this is the problem. So in my opinion, because I think this price action is already over because we have here a huge drop. So that means if we just would do a Fibonacci retracement based on the last move, which we have, guys, and this is a little bit scary, to be honest with you, but we have to face the truth. This is what the technicals are saying. If we cannot hold this support here at $2.58, which I honestly don't think because always when we hit the bottom of this trend channel, we had a technical reaction. So this was, of course, perfectly aligning with the Fibonacci that's why that was so easy to trade here lucid i made uh, several videos on that in the past you can watch them here on my channel but in my opinion guys if we you know if we close this gap here three dollar sixty two then it's possible guys that we come all the way back down here even at one dollar seventy or even lower guys i'm sorry to say that but based on the technicals this is possible yeah when we now uh, i will also talk about the bull case in a second here so when we now switch to the uh, fintel information then we can see that the short interest of uh, Lucid is 30.6%, guys, 200, almost 270 million shares are short. So you have to understand, you know, if you want to hold the stock in the long term, you have here a very, very strong opponent, guys. Your enemy are the short sellers and the short sellers, when they short 30% of the float, that means they don't agree with the actual price. This is far far too expensive otherwise you would not have this kind of short interest and that means guys when we scroll down here 270 million shares so this is an all-time high you can see when whenever we compare the 30 percent this is an all-time high for the short interest of lucid we never never ever had this kind of short interest 30 percent even even we trade here far below the 10 dollar range and have new all-time lows here the $2.54 was a new all-time low for the stock, guys. That's why you have to understand, you know, if you want to hold the stock here in the long term, that can be very, very risky and you can lose all your money very, very quick because when they start to do stock splits and stuff like that, then the amount of shares will get lower and lower on your broker account and your minus gets bigger and bigger. So be very careful, guys. You need to understand what is happening here behind the scenes. The float is now 885 million shares. And it's very, very possible that they make some more delusion here because the problem is, guys, and I think this is what the short sellers already do know. We have here shares outstanding of 2.3 yeah, billion, also 2.3 billion shares outstanding. So if Lucid would convert these shares into public tradable shares, guys, sayonara, uh, then, then even we can talk about prices below $1 because the delusion would yeah massively guys so be be careful guys i just want to, to point that out you have to make your own decisions you have to make your own trading strategy but i would never hold this stock in the long term because there is so much potential for delusion but the good thing is guys if we squeeze out if we can break out here out of this trend channel and start to close those open gaps here guys then we could talk about the potential short squeeze scenario for lucid but unt until then guys as long as you're trading here in this channel this is, in my opinion, not on the table yet. Guys, that was my update for you on Lucid. I hope that was helpful. As I said, if this is too complicated for you, if you don't know what I'm talking about here, if you need help, guys, then you can, as I said, join in here, Elite Circle Membership. I will here explain you everything on trading. You can also ask me whatever you want. I answer all your questions here on trading, indicators, short squeeze stocks, whatever you want to ask me. I will help you guys and being that said by the way we have more than 100 members already so every day new members joining in so i think someday guys at some point i have to limit this membership but for now we have still some uh, room to go so if you want to join in guys feel free thank you so much guys i wish you great success with your trades great success with lucid always take profits guys don't forget and be careful and being that said thank you for your support arigato gozaimasu vielen dank alles gute und bis bald take care guys bye bye